Hi shark swimmers and families. My name is Louisa Klitsch. I'm the secretary of the shark swim team. I'm just here to update you and to talk about tomorrow, our first swim team practices tomorrow, which we are really excited about. Um, we just wanted to thank you guys all for your patience with us, um, the board, just getting things put together. We've been working for several weeks now trying to decide how this is all gonna work and how we would like to see things go. Also following the rules and the guidelines, there's new stuff that comes out almost every day it feels like. So we are really just trying to get all that together, make sure we are following everything that we can um, to make it a safe and fun year for your swimmer. So um, like we said before in the email, we're excited that Coach Wesley and Coach Maddie will be returning this year along with Coach Colleen. She will be helping out a couple days a week um, with some swim practices. I also will be helping out um, on Wednesdays and you'll see a bunch of other board members out helping take temperatures, that kind of stuff. So um, feel free to say hi. Uh, let's see here, so $80 swim this year. Uh, we decided as a board that because it's not a normal season um, to do that. So we're really excited about that to be able to offer that to our team. Um, obviously that's only for this year as of right now. Um, if you have not paid your $80, it's imperative that you do so. It is holds your spot for this year. We have had a lot, a lot of interest in the swim team, so we wanna make sure you get your spot. Um, I know some of you have emailed and asked if you could bring the check tomorrow, which is just fine, but if you haven't reached out to us and let us know, um, please do so, that would be great. Um, also make sure you have your um, sharks, your COVID waiver, your, um, sharks release risk and release agreement and then your sharks commitment agreement please bring those tomorrow there will be board members on site to grab those for you um couple rules swimmers must check in at the pool gate at the start of practice you'll line up six feet apart i have, will include a little how-to video on that kind of what that's going to look like um so no parents or families are allowed on the deck or grass area during practice um, I know this is going to be a little difficult. Uh, we apologize about this. Unfortunately, it's the Horse to Swim Leagues and um, also the Larimer County Health District's rules on that. If that changes, we will let you know. However, we suggest that you um, go to the O'Day field that's directly behind the pool. Um, bring your own chairs, blankets, anything like that to hang out back there. Um, also, please remember that if you're going to stick around um, to be respectful of the neighborhood and the people around, not be too loud. Um, if you have any questions on that, please reach out and let, let us know. Um, you can't use the locker rooms to change. You can use the bathrooms if swimmers need to use bathrooms, but please no changing. Please come dressed for swim and then head out at the end. Um, if you want to bring equipment like a kickboard, um, I am gonna provide one for my little girl. You are welcome to provide one, but it needs to only be used by your family, brought in and out. It cannot stay at the pool. Um, no swimmers allowed to loiter on the pool deck uh, before or after practice. Please wear your mask when you enter the pool deck, and then when you're about ready to get in the pool, you can take it off. You do not need to wear them in the pool. There's not gonna be any competitions between other swimming pools. However, we're gonna plan some fun things um, with the sharks and come up with our own stuff. So look forward to that, that's exciting. Um, attendance will be taken at the beginning of practice, um, just so we kind of know who's there. It is really important that you stay with your allotted practice time. We cannot um, have flexibility to switch different times. So if you miss a Wednesday morning at 6.30, you cannot come to other times that Wednesday. You will just need to come to your allotted time at the next spot. We are only allowed so many swimmers at a time and we do not have flexibility to switch around. If you have any questions, please reach out to any one of us. Um, we are excited for tomorrow, um, excited for the swim season, and are excited to um, just kick everything off. If you have any questions, like I said, please reach out. Um, otherwise, I can't wait to see your smiling faces tomorrow. Family feeling?
feeling sick? Yeah. Cough? Yeah. Shortness of breath? Yeah. Any other symptoms? Yeah. You're good to go. Please make sure to keep your swim equipment and swim bags six feet apart. Once you've placed your stuff down, if you've brought a water bottle, you can put it with you at your lane. Masks should be worn at the start of each practice when taking temperatures. They can be removed right before practice starts before you get into the water. Please make sure at this point to stay socially distant. Family members can stay in the same spot as long as they are from the same family. Once practice is over and you've gathered your things, you will then exit out of the side exit.